Harris Sultan, do you want to watch Freed Response Proof of Prophethood series? And do you people think the standard narrative in the Hadith sources are real? What is your opinion? I don't. I definitely don't want to watch Freed Response because uh, Freed is responses because they're so stupid this is the guy who said that um uh, you know wh why not a lot of people have seen the splitting of the moon like the indians and the chinese because they were all sleeping <laughs> it was the night time you know they were all sleeping what do you expect them to go out there with binoculars with <laughs> telescopes to, to be looking out you stupid people that's the reason nobody looked at it. nobody saw that so think, how do you think that that's like a ta -dum, psh, mic drop? <laughs> <laughs> they were sleeping. What's wrong with you? They gen <laughs> This is no what I meant by that. The waves and the tides. Nah, forget oh, that. Oh, by the way, everyone was asleep. Oh, by the way, this is no Farid is not the person when I was talking about. Oh, these serious looking men. Farid looks like a clown anyway. I was talking about Yasser Kadi, Shabi Ali. Those guys I was talking about. They look like serious people, intelligent people. Farid is so stupid. <laughs> He's just stupid. Like he, he, you know what, Nuria? He genuinely thought because he would have thought about it. He would have contemplated it. He would have thought, okay, this is how I'm going to approach this issue, uh, because they're defend, defending the indefensible. Yeah, so they they, they sit yeah. down and they, they can't sleep and they 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 see our faces and it makes them angry. That oh, you know, like, that arrogant son of a bitch. He said this. I'm gonna I'm gonna answer it. He's thinking. He's like, hmm, how do I respond? To this this is a difficult one to get out of. Spl a splitting of the moon. How do I? Mm, the moon broke into. Problem solved. People were sleeping. He, th th <laughs> this is his mind working. And in his mind, at that moment when he came up with that argument, he was like, "Well done, Farid. I got yeah. this. I got this." <laughs> For real. So, so these so are the guys with you. would have double checked that that response with someone else, you know, and been like, "How about I just say everyone was sleeping? That that I cover my back, right?" It, it Hijab still would be like, mm. <laughs> "Mama, Hijab would have been like, mm, no, I, I, I don't think." But he, who knows? He might have asked another stupid guy, Ali Dava. Ali Dava, yeah, man, that's perfect. <laughs> that's perfect. Yeah, that'll shut those bloody ex Muslim yeah, atheists up. How could they see it? Yeah, yeah, makes sense, bro. Makes sense. <laughs> Oh my word. Yeah, and so, we have so, to talk about Muhammad Hijab and what he's recently said as well. Oh, we're, we're going to talk about this. We're going to yeah, talk about this. So, yeah. so we're just going to wrap it up with Jojo's okay. comment. So do you people think the standard narrative in the Ahadith st stories are real? What is your opinion on that? You know, like I'm really, really divided because sometimes it feels like, um, you know, I had some of these Ahadiths are just put out there just to insult Muhammad. Like, you know, like, for example, he would do rounds in one night and have sexual intercourse with all his wives. You know, like, even if he did do that, would he actually put it, would he actually want this information to be out? But some people say... Um, I think uh, they saw that as quite miraculous, you know? And like, no, it's but a, Ali a thing of strength and, and the yeah, because he was I, able to do that. <clears throat> exactly. Ali, Ali Sina had a point in his book. He actually said that he spread that information, this rumor deliberately... Because he was an he, because he was impotent and he yeah. wanted people to know that I'm the real guy. That that's the reason. You know the other hadith that I uh, that I've told you before, um, where Muhammad had his sex slave, uh, who was Maria Kiptia, apparently he had a but, son but, with. Yes, yeah. uh, but she uh, she was lashed for uh, cheating on him, and then when this other guy she went to, uh, when the the guy whom she was accused of having sex with. When Ali went there to to behead him, he didn't have uh, uh, his he, he didn't even have his penis. So that person, that story again, like again, that that's a problem, yeah. So where are the four, um, uh, where are the four witnesses? How? Why was he not stoned? Why did you send an assassin to behead him? Blah blah blah. But again, that that story that the guy didn't have his penis. Ali Sina recommends, he says that Muhammad also spread that story because it would have been insulting for him that, hey, look, your own sex slave is cheating on you. Um, so to, because other people were spreading the rumor, uh, Muhammad had no idea. So if he if other people are saying that that looks bad on him and that says a lot about his manhood. So he spread that story that, OK, the person you're accusing Maria of having sex with he doesn't even have it. He doesn't even have a dick. So, yeah. um, <laughs> that, that, um, so who knows? Who knows? But I, I, I don't know. I, 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 there must be a lot of bullshit in there, obviously. Yeah. Um, so, 
and the standard narrative as holes. Look, people, once they know it, it's not even that much of a deal. Like, I mean, that's why Arab Muslims don't have a problem with uh, d different versions of the Quran. But this is new to Pakistani Muslims and non-Arabic speaking Muslims. They get troubled. Even now in my Urdu streams when I tell them that, hey, you know what? There's a Warsh Quran as well. Do you? And there's seven others as well. And I've got this, I've got a slideshow uh, presentation from Abdullah Gondal. I just bring it up. I'm like, hey, look at these these differences. They're like hundred differences that Gondal has written. Um, so, uh, so they're like, ah, uh, what is this? So they, it, it's a problem for them. Uh, I think we need to move on. And to help me produce more videos like these, support me on Patreon or PayPal.